Hey, what's happening, y'all? My name is Lance Silvertooth, and this is Omori. All right, so caution real quick. The game contains depiction of depression, anxiety, suicide, and may not be suitable for all audiences. Wow. All right. So first off, what a beautiful intro music to this game. I'm really excited to play this one out. Uh, there's a lot of positive and great reviews on the store Steam page. I definitely recommend you checking them out if you're interested in buying a game. Uh, some of the comments that uh, really stood out to me is that it's difficult to play the game when when you can't see through your tears. It's really that emotional. Uh, apparently, but uh, yeah, this is a complete blind playthrough of this game. I've I, I've only seen some screenshots on the sourcing page, obviously, but that's about it. I know that it's a psycholo psychological horror RPG, which I love. I love horror games, so so let's go ahead and do that. Uh, I don't know why I would press continue, but here we go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, don't please don't forget to like, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Everything is going to be okay. Mm. No matter what happens. Promise me that we'll always be there for each other. Promise me. Welcome to White Space. Hmm. You have been living here for as long as you can remember. This this reminds me of the Pokemon games on the Game Boy. <laughs> Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Yes. Oh, it's a, a severed head. Interesting. Looks cool. There's a cat with tears of uh, blood drops going into the. A ton of other cats. There seems to be me on the tub. There's a big snake that seems to be a mountain as well. There's a slide with blood on it, I think. <laughs> What's going on here? I think there's me lying on the bed and there's a cat giving me something. Some kind of an ice bag on my head too. Those light bulbs with the eyes on it? There's me by itself on the floor. Hmm, interesting sketchbook. Tissue box for wiping your sorrows away. Hmm. Meow. Waiting for something to happen? Maybe. You booted up your laptop. What would you like to do, stare at the screen? Sure. You stared at the screen. What would you like to do? Open your journal. Today I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Today I visited my friends. Everything was okay. Today I visited my friends. Everything was okay. Oh, this is like the same thing for each day almost. 
Uh, white space. There's just a lot of time spent with friends, so which is good, right? Alright, we can log off. The heat from the laptop warmed your la lap. It felt nice. Oh, what is that? <laughs> the warm of the laptop felt nice. Seems like he needs a, a, a warm hug. Something fell nearby. Let's take a look. Whoa. There's a knife. You got a shiny knife. What the heck is this? Ow! What the frick? What the heck is that? What are these things? Are they trying to get me? What would happen? Oh. Just brings me back to, to my room. To my white space. I can run. I didn't know I can run. Okay, let's go through the door. A white door cast a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Open the door. Whoa, this is like a DMT trip or something. Where am I? <laughs> Aubrey, hi, Omari. We were hoping that you'd come by soon. Wanna play cards with us? We were just about to start another game. Oh, whoops. Never mind. Oh, man, what the heck, Aubrey? This is Cal. You messed up all the cards. I was winning too. Hero, hey there, Cal. There's no need to get angry. It's just a game, after all. Don't give me that, hero. You only say that because you were losing, Cal. Is that an egg on the floor? Who wouldn't eat the breakfast? Aubrey, why is Cal always so mean to me? Oh, I'm sorry, Cal. Uh, Aubrey. You know, the other day, that good-for-nothing stole my stuffed toy and hid it somewhere in this room. Why would he do something like that? He's so immature. I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Omori? Pretty please? Okay, let's go see. What's this? In? There's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. A cat-shaped hole. What is that? Uh, baseball bat. More eggs. A blender. A neatly wrapped present. A fluffy pillow shaped like a head of a girl. Would you like to make a toast? Yes. Cute. <laughs> he made a toast. A photo of someone familiar. What is that? A single bean on a plate. It looks like we're on a trip, for real. Some kind of a trip going on. <laughs> you got stuffed toy. A tentacle is poking out of the ground. A tentacle? What the frick is going on? Where, where am I? <laughs> I got your toy, Aubrey. Is that... Could, could it be? She did a twirl for us. Snatch the stuffed toy from you. Hey, Cal. Look, it's my stuffed toy. What the heck? Where'd you get that? Maury found it. Lucky for me, I've got some real friends. Serves you right, Cal. You should know better than to pick on others. But Aubrey started it. She was the one who was making fun of me for the mole on my... Oh, no, Aubrey. On your what? <laughs> On his butt. Hero. Aubrey. Fine. Man. Aubrey always gets what she wants. Hey, Omori. I'm glad that's all settled. 
Those two always seem to be bumping heads. Marie and Basil invited us for a picnic at the playground. Did you want to go see them? Sure. Alright everyone, let's go see Marie and Basil. Just like Final Fantasy, the old games. Is this a snake going out, Amori? Here's your allowance for today. Wow, thank you. <laughs> you got 50 clams. The clams must be what's this giant, giant cat just staring at us. Oh yeah, fresh air at last. Gotta love that nature. Well, let's go. Hey, wait a sec. Help me up, guys. I'm stuck. Only if you say please. Aubrey, Kale, stop messing around. Get me out of here. Okay, okay, fine. <laughs> Took you long enough. Well, sorry, princess. Yo, I don't know what it is about this song, but it's already making me so emotional. <laughs> it's a pretty good song. I don't know why I would go back there, but let's go back out. What's over here? I feel like this is the wrong wrong way. Do you want to build sand castles with your friends? Sure. <laughs> what? Is that who who's who built that city? Is that Cal or Hero? <laughs> That's hilarious. That happened so quick. Whoa! What the fuck was that? You are afraid of drowning. What the heck was that? That looked... That looked pretty spooky. Um, definitely the wrong way. It's over here to the left. It's a lamppost. Oh, I don't think I can go through here yet. You're afraid of spiders. I love spiders. So, what is this on this run? Okay. Wrong way, guys. Sorry. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's head back down. Such a simple... Um music but yet so uh, so beautiful is that our the rest of our friends okay Marie Basil oh hello Aubrey hello everyone how are you all doing today Kale's being mean to me again. Oh no, not again. How could he? Psh, I'm not being mean. Aubrey's just being all whiny. Well, Kale, you've just made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. <laughs> believe me! No, believe me! I don't know. <laughs> Sigh. Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you being all responsible. I really like that about you. Heh <laughs> Come on, Marie. Not now. Aw. You embarrassed him. You made him all shy. Oh, hero, you know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. <laughs> While we're waiting for you guys, Basil and I were going through his photo album. Did you want to join us? Of course. After all, we're the ones in the pictures, aren't we? Basil, Basil, get a load of this. <laughs> C 
Come on, Basil, take a picture of me. Sorry, Cal, I only take photos of people when they least expect it. You like to take photos of people acting naturally when they're not in front of the camera? Right, Basil? Yeah, there's something special about everyone living their own lives. Those are the moments I want to capture. So, like, we just have to pretend you're not there? Haha, <laughs> yeah, I guess you could put it that way. Sure, I can do that. Did you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Uh, okay, but it's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop doubting yourself. I'm sure they'll be great. Basil's being humble. You're right, Aubrey. Sorry, I'll try to believe in myself more. Here, this way we can all see. They seem to be all nice, honestly. Alright, what do we got? This is me, Omori. Marie is teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Omori and Kel are holding Marie's example. So pretty, it is pretty. Omori and Kel gave up and ran off, but Aubrey and I got the hang of it really fast. Hmm. Hero's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting it. You have to admire his persistence. Everyone's eating watermelons. So juicy! Aubrey has some seeds on her face. Maybe someone should tell her. <laughs> Kale drinking a bottle of milk, his favorite. Oh, I didn't know he's got long hair. I shouldn't get too close or it might get my camera wet. That's me. Marie had Hero take a picture of us. Everyone thinks a flower crown really suits me. That's Omori and Basil, right? I, was that Basil in the beginning of the game on the intro? Hero leaning in for a smooch. <laughs> Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, brotherly love. Are they brothers? Or is that just like friendly brotherly love? We're having a picnic today. Marie wanted to take a picture of everyone. Say cheese. After eating, everyone fell asleep except Hiro and Marie. I'm getting kind of sleepy myself. Cal said he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. All of our feet in a circle. Can you guess whose feet are whose? Yeah. I can, <laughs> because I'm the only person that's wearing a sock. Socks, I should say, sorry. So funny. All right. These photos are all so charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. Thanks, I didn't take all of them though. Marie likes to steal my camera sometimes. Only sometimes. Hey, I have an idea. Did you all want to come hang out at my house? I just finished planting some little sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Yeah, sure, that sounds fun. Let's go. It's out of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. Hmm, I think I'll sit this one out. You all go on and enjoy yourselves. Come on, Marie. But if you're ever feeling wary, you can always stop by one of my picnics. I'll always have some refreshments ready. You can even save using my picnic basket. Oh, that's a save point. Aw, thanks, Marie. You're always doing so much for us. Bye, Marie. We'll see you again soon. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Yeah, I... They seem to be such good friends, to be honest. They seem to have a really good vibe going on, like connection going on. So 
I like that. And even the music, they paired it up so well with that whole interaction. Um, or introduction, I should say. What is this? Ah, yeah, some nutritious candy. Nutritious candy? Is there any such thing? Would you like to eat some? Sure. <laughs> what just happened? You and your friends feel like new. Is this like a... It heals our HP? Alright, so this must be the picnic bath. Would you like to save? Yes, sure. Cool. Let's save. There we go. Forest playground. 20 minutes. 20 minutes in the books. Now what's going on over here? Burly. Hey, Omori, guess what? I got some plans today. Big plans. Just stay put for a while. You'll see what I mean soon enough. Okay. <clears throat> Wonder what he's talking about. Ben, what is this thing? Burly talks so fast when she's excited. It gets really hard to keep up. Is this, um, there's like a mix of natural and supernatural. Nose is my best friend. This is Bun. She can't say much, but she's really smart. That must be Nose over there. Burly. Hey, wait, just one second. Where'd you all think you're going? <clears throat> you can't leave without joining us for a game of hide and seek. Stay and play with us. The more, the merrier. Okay. You want to play hide and seek again? But you know how this turned out last time. It, yeah, sorry, Burly. I think we're going to have pass. We're going to Basil's house now, so we'll catch up with you later. Not so fast. You guys trying to avoid me again? What's up with you two? Is it my face? My rough and tough exterior? At least I'm not as bad as boss. It's a good thing I banned him from the playing around after what happened last time. Also, it was boss's fault. I wonder what that moron is up to now. <laughs> uh, good riddance. So, you want to play hide and seek, Basil? I can go either way. There's no rush to get to my house after all. I think I'll leave it up to Mori. What do you want to do? Uh, why? Why me? Omori, Omori! My best friend! <laughs> He's all, he's all trying to convince me to stay and play. Come on, you know how to play hide and seek, don't you? Yes. It's not a matter of whether I do know or not. It's a matter of whether I want to or not. Yeah, that's what I thought. What's stopping you then? Come on, let's play around everyone up. You just want to play. Ten hut. Oh, there's a lot, a lot of kids here. Burly. All right, maggots. <laughs> Here's the rules. We're going to be entertaining ourselves with a little game of hide and seek. Here in my hands, I got some straws. See? Hey, see now. Everyone here has got to pick a straw. The one with the shortest straw is going to be it. And we'll have to find everyone else. Sounds easy enough, right? I bet it's gonna be me. I'm gonna have to find everyone. We all got our straws. Good. Now, let's see who's gonna be it. Well, well, well. Looks like the one with the shortest straw is Omori. What a surprise. Oh, wait. Omori is it? But Omori doesn't like to be alone. Hmm. He doesn't like being alone. That's... I don't know. That makes me sad. Are you gonna be okay, Omori? I can take your place if you want. Oh, Basil's nice. He's nice. He's really nice. I don't mind, really. Hey, I hear you plotting over there. The straws make the rules, not me. Come on, don't be babies. It ain't so bad. 
Omori will be fine. When you're ready to play, walk up to the tether ball, pull, and close your eyes. And no picking or else. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Sigh. I don't know where to hide. I'm not creative at all. <laughs> uh, yay! It's time to play. His name is Happy. He's seems to be happy, right? Don't worry, Omori. I know you'll be okay. You can do this. I believe in you, Omori. You got this in the bag, buddy. You'll be fine, Omori. Just believe in yourself. Those goes. I wonder if you're me and no should hide. Mm. <sighs> I feel sleepy. Charlene. I'll try, I'll, try, I'll try my best. Seems to be whispering, right? Van. Hmm, can I even hide anywhere around here? <laughs> you'll, I'm sure you'll find a spot, big guy. Just examine a pole when you want to start. Come on, Amori. Don't be a baby. Don't be a big baby. Alright, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Go. What? That's not even a hiding spot. What the heck? Whoa, you found me. Now I can help you find everyone. <laughs> Just don't tell Burly about this. Got it? What a... Oh, what a nice friend. He did that on purpose. Turns out, there's not many places to hide for a guy my size, but this was still fun. As long as Burly's happy, I'm happy. Oh, what a good friend. What's that? Is there somebody there? Boing, it's me, Happy. You found me, so that means I gotta do something else now. <laughs> oh, I know, I'm gonna count the alphabet backwards. I don't know why, but I find this so freaking cute. Z, Y, X, W, V, U, O. <laughs> um, O. Alright. There's nobody else there, right? Okay. What? Joker Jash. Peekaboo. You weren't even hiding. Darn, you found me. I guess that means I lose. You know what Happy would say right now? She'd say something like, Bang, she should always try your best at everything. How else will people see how awesome you are? Next time, I guess. You are awesome, Bangs. I think you are awesome. Yo, yo. Come on. Why is everybody just hiding in plain sight? Charlene. Uh, she doesn't say much, huh? What's this over here? A suspicious blue mailbox. Are these... I don't think they were part of our... Neb and Daisy. They're whispering. You probably shouldn't disturb this. What's that other person? Oh, okay. That's how people talk and the train sometimes in the Philippines. <laughs> it's... Huff, huff, huff. We're not playing. We're exercising. <clears throat> huff, huff, huff. We're not playing. We're exercising. Oh, it's the same thing. What's this guy doing? Browse. Ah! Building blocks. I like how he's supposedly hiding, but he's just running in circles. <laughs> Mikal. Michael. How do you say that? Huh? Where am I? Sai, I was dreaming that I was on a private beach with servants fanning me with palm tree leaves on every side. When suddenly, wham! And now here I am. I must have fallen asleep while hiding. I guess that's game over for me. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Michael. Mikhail. A bunch of small toy cars. Aubrey! Aw, you found me, darn. Let's go find everyone else together, Mori. Okay. What is this? A very difficult puzzle piece. All the pieces are blank. That is seems to be difficult. Okay, that's everybody that I found so far, right? 
No boss zone. A violators will be prosecuted. Oh. Oh no, boss. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, here's... Nose goes. Shh, if you're too loud, they'll hear us. Nose goes. Bond goes. Ah, uh, be quiet. Nose, we're hiding, remember? <laughs> Aha! We found you, Bun and Nose. Nose, they found us. Nose goes. Oh, you know I can't stay mad at you. Let's go play patty cake. You're so cute. Alright, is that it? Who else? How many people there are? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's only one more, I think. Hi, Amori. I see everyone decided to play. To stay a bit to play, hide and seek. If you're having a hard time, I can lend you a hand. Big sister is always here for you. So cute. So, would you like to help? Like some help? Yes. From what I can see, there's still three friends left behind. You can do this, Amori. I'm rooting for you. Okay. There's three more friends. Okay. Oh. Where'd you come from? Oh, hey, guys. Huff, you know, Huff. I found a really good hiding spot, but Huff. Sean and Ren uh, invited me to join in them in their exercise routine. It's fun and good for you. You guys should really try this. It's really a workout. Oh, man, I'm so tired. Wow, you really don't know how to say no to anyone, do you, hero? Come on, hero. We gotta help Amori find everyone else. Alright, alright. I'm coming. Bye, Sean. Bye, Ren. This was fun. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this again sometime. See you later, hero. There's actually people like that. They really just say yes to everything. And it's... And I, I can understand because it's... It's hard to say no sometimes. It's like... You know, you feel like you're being like a, a downer if you say, say no sometimes. There's a straw in the ground. Pull it out? Yes, that's definitely somebody. I bet that's Burly. <laughs> I was just about to say it's Burly. Took you guys long enough. I thought I was gonna suffocate in there. Well, you weren't in there in the first place. So what are you talking about? How'd you like my hiding spot? Pretty good, eh? It looks like we pretty much found everyone else too. Unexpected, but I like it. Let's do a final roll call. Okay. Ten. Huh. Ben here as always, buddy. Charlene. Here. Michael. Mikhail. I gotta find out how to pronounce that that word. Zzz. Sleeping again? Oh, what gives? <laughs> Dreaming about the servants fanning him, apparently. Happy. Here, here. Browse. Ah. <laughs> Browse just ran so fast. Here. Bun. Bun is here. Nose, nose goes. Hero, present. Cal. Uh, you really gotta do this every time, Burley. <laughs> that was uncalled for. Oh, barely. Aubrey. Here I am. She likes to do the tutorials. Huh? Where's Basil? Oh yeah. You're right. Where's Basil? That's strange. I thought I saw him go hiding near that tree over there. Basil, where are you? Can you hear us? Basil, you can come out now. You already won. Why do I have a bad feeling about this? Hello? Basil? I think it's giving me a, a, a bad feeling because of the psychological horror um, description. Hey, there's Basil. Ooh, it's making me nervous. Basil, are you okay? Are you stuck? It 
Boss. Das Boss. Boss, I should have known it was you. Good for nothing, scoundrel. Let Basil go. Yeah, what did Basil ever do to you? Basil is our friend. Don't you dare hurt him. Let go of Basil, boss. He didn't do anything wrong. You stupid heads. <laughs> That's not nice. You think this is about Basil? Don't play dumb. You know why I'm here. How dare you not invite me to hide and seek? I'm the one who showed you all how to play in the first place. You're not even playing it right. How can you call it hide and seek without any body slamming? Body slamming? This is not WWE wrestling. My flower crown! Hey, that's the flower crown we made for Basil. How could you? Let go of him, you bully. No, if I can play with everyone, then no one can. What a bully. This is a boss only zone now. And you're not invited. Ugh. Whoa. First fight. Yeah. What will Omori and friends do? Fight. What do we got? Attack, skill, snack, and toy. Uh, let's. What? Uh, sad poem. Inflict sad on a friend or foe. Let's try that. That's cool. <laughs> Switch sides. Okay, well, we want to do it for the, the foes, right? Okay. Uh, this is Aubrey now? Okay. Snack, skill, pep talk. Okay, let's do a pep talk. Let's do for Mori. And it's Kel do Kel's Annoy. So let's try to annoy the boss. Okay. And then Hero's gonna skill. Cook heals a friend for 75% of their heart, so that's cure. Let's just do a regular attack, but what's this toy? No, there's nothing in there, or there's nothing on the snack either. So regular attack, let's see what happens. Here we go. Mori reads a sad poem. Kel annoys boss. Takes 16 damage. Omori, uh, I mean, boss. Cracks his knuckles. <laughs> Mori, this time we're just gonna attack. Aubrey, this time we're just gonna... We're gonna do another pep talk for me. Let's do it with Hero. Um, we're just gonna do an attack as well. And attack. See what happens. 26 damage. It was a moving attack. I did such a bad bluff. You weaklings! You call that an attack? What is that? Was that a ball? You can do it! Here's a hero. 25 damage. Boss punches Kel. Ooh! That was 25. That was a pretty bad attack. I like this song though. Bip, 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 bip. Sorry. <laughs> no, it was pretty hype. Pretty hype song. I, I almost want to be like this. The entire time. Just, everybody's just gonna attack. 29 damage. Hey, that kind of hurt. <laughs> this isn't fun anymore. 12 damage. 18 damage. Grr. Now you've made me angry. Look at Basil. What is he? He's like over there, just slumped over. It's time for my special move. Body slam. Oh no. That's not good. 80 damage. I turned into a toast. We all turned into a toast. Omar took 80 damage. Omar did not succumb. <gasps> There's a dark side coming up. Huh? 
how are you still moving? Oh snap. What will Omori and Prince fight? This to an attack. Omori takes 30 damage. Whoa! Omori parties was victorious. Everybody else toasted except for me. 32 XP. 22 clams. Nice. Very nice. This isn't fair. Rematch. I want a rematch. Basil, are you hurt? Aw, oh, don't worry about me. I'm just fine. Boss, it must hurt to see some people have fun without you. Oh. This is Basil talking. Basil has this like really, really good energy. I feel like I, I feel like Basil is just a really good person. But that doesn't mean you can ruin other people's fun. Hm. I know that. Oh, Basil. There. Does that feel better? Basil, are you sure it's okay to do that? Boss is bad news. It's a good thing Amori held on during that final attack, or else we would have all been toast. <laughs> it's okay, I trust him. We were when we were all fighting, he tried really hard to make sure I didn't get hurt. Is that true, boss? <laughs> That's a load of baloney. I don't need to hear these lies. Oh, this is my spot. No one else is welcome here. Oh, boss. <laughs> well, he probably won't be a problem as long as he stays like that. I guess that means we go. We can go to Basil's house now. That sounds good to me. We're leaving now, boss. Don't cause any trouble, okay? Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. I feel like, you know, everybody just needs some kind of kindness. Maybe boss is that person who he feels isolated somehow. Maybe because of the way he acts, obviously, right? In the end, he just really, I feel like he just really want to be a part of something. And I feel like that's, a, that's what a lot of bullies do. They just want to be a part of things. And they just don't know how to do it in a better way. And they, I think it takes somebody like Basil to, to reach out to them so that they can crack that shell, crack that guard. They have some kind of something obvious maybe happened to him. Some kind of a, I'm not saying that's an excuse to act that way, but something might have happened to him back home or like an experience that makes him this way. So that's all I got to say about that. So I'm Bezos is such a good person, um, especially tearing that poster out, you know, and hopefully that made boss feel better. I'm going to go ahead and save this. Uh, what an awesome first episode. I hope you guys like that. Let me know what you guys think about the game so far. Let me know in the comments down below. Make sure if you guys like the video, make sure to like and subscribe for more. Uh, hit that notification bell so you can get notified the next time I have an episode out. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.